What's up guys, Zinigami here, and let's go through 30 Stamina T-Bone Island. And I'm going to be, the condition for T-Bone Island is that you can only bring Psy, Int, or Quick Units, which are blue, purple, or yellow units to island. And I'm going to be using a double Ray Ray team with Alkiji, which is only there because he hits hard. Enel is only there because he hits hard. Don Krieg is really important, and Golden Pound Usopp is really nice to have too. So the reason we're bringing Don Krieg is because the boss T Bone will actually put up a I can't be killed buff for five turns. So for five turns he can't be killed, and you have two options: you can either stall him out by using like uh, Golden Pound Usopp and Mister Three to stall him out. With the Golden Pound Usopp and Mister Three, you only take one attack from him. Or just use Don Krieg. And what Don Krieg will do is, since his special is a poison, the poison will actually hit. Uh, the poison is you want to get him down to his one hit point left, and then the poison goes through the uh, I can't be killed ability. So, and this works on any uh, I can't be killed ability, including like Afro Luffy. So you just use this and you'll be fine. Uh, all these stages up to now, up to the mini boss jo uh, Jerry doesn't really matter. They all are just kind of guys. Nothing super special about them. The secret stage is T Bone himself again, and when you get the T Bone secret stage, it'll be T Bone plus two other units, and T Bone will actually show up and then kill himself, and he'll drop. He'll either and T Bone either drops himself or a skill or Stronghold Shanks skill book. And of course the oh here we go there we go done there's the secret stage how convenient bum 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 and goodbye there we go we got T Bone himself and that's what happens now you can see now you can see the secret stage uh, if you're wondering for like what this stage would have normally been this stage would have just been like kept, like regular units and turtles and pigs or something like that. There's a secret stage. Super fun, right? And once again, more stages of just guys and evolution units in the back. The next stage will be... Uh, I keep wanting to call him Jer uh, Johnny, but he's Jerry. So Jerry will do one of three things. Jerry will either lock all your int units for two turns, he will either give you all bother orbs, so that, that's lock all in units for two turns, obviously. He will either give you all bother orbs, uh, well, not all bother orbs, I'm sorry, he'll give you bother orbs instead of, um, instead of psi orbs, and then lock the bother orbs, or he'll boost his own defense, which is the nice, is the easiest one to deal with. And since we got the, he locked down most of my team, all I'm gonna do is kinda just beat him down a little bit, but hope for some food orbs. So I can heal up a bit. No food orbs. Oh well. And we'll just take care of Jerry now. Goodbye, Jerry. It was fun having you around. T Bone! T Bone puts up a preemptive uh, anti can't be killed for five turns. I'm going to go ahead and use Golden Pound Usopp. I'm going to go ahead and use Don Krieg. Boom, boom. Don Krieg. Boom, boom. And what he will do is T Bone will actually alternate his attack between his special and his regular attack. His special attack will be 6,400 damage. His regular attack is 3,200 damage. So he'll attack for 6,000, he'll attack for 3,000, attack for 6,000, attack for 3,000. And we'll just alternate back and forth between those two. But since I do have Don Creek Poison on, I can just push him. I don't want to get him to under 20% really. But I should, yeah, I have enough damage to kill him right here. With an orb on my own guy. I bring him down to one health and it's poison from Don Creek kills him. So Don Creek makes this island super, super easy. Uh, other ways you can do it, you can also use a person's special ability. So you can bring him down to zero, to zero and then use someone's special ability to get through like a Vista, a Vista, uh, Vista or something like that will get through his uh, 
We'll also get through the endurance of his. That's another excellent way to take care of that. Uh, T-Bone himself, let me go down to T-Bone. Uh, Jerry is useless. Jerry is most or more or less useless. His special ability, his captain ability is worthless, don't even bother. His special ability is like Vivi, where it shuffles all the orbs, but it also gives you a chance of getting bother orbs. Which I don't know why you'd ever want that. It's not even a reliable shuffle, it's just shuffle everything and chance of having bother orbs too. T-Bone, his captain ability is worthless, his tapping ability is 1.5 times attack, 1.2 times recovery, something like that. Just worthless. Don't even bother. His special, however, T-Bone's special is kind of nifty. What T-Bone's special does is he is a knowledge, a knowledge slasher, a psi knowledge slasher, those are bad, that's very important, is that he will uh, cut your health by 80% of your current health. So cuts your health by 80%. He will deal five times how much damage he cut in damage. So let's say you're using like a double Garp team or a double Blackbeard team and you have them on there. You cut like 50,000 health and then you deal 250,000 damage as neutral damage. It's not as side damage, it's just neutral damage, uh, which is really fun. But the more, and he also reduce the damage taken by your next turn for by 90%. So he's really cool in, for example, a, a, uh, a new six star croc team. Since you wanna be under that current threshold, health threshold, he's also great on like a Blackbeard team. Any team that wants to be under 30% health, he's really, really good for because he just use him, he automatically turns on that captain ability of yours. And by reducing damage taken by 90%, he also save you for a turn of damage whenever you're at really low damage there. So probably one of the better like white beard or something enablers. And our other guy, Jerry. Jerry, 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 Jerry. Jerry's not favorited yet. Jerry. 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 Jerry's more or less useless, don't get him. So once again, the best thing about this island is uh, T-Bone himself is pretty good to have. Strong Shanks books, amazing. Koza. Koza is a really nice slasher attack booster. 4 star croc, most people won't have 4 star croc, most people have 5 star croc instead, but 4 star croc is kinda useful because his is a special. Lion Song Zoro books are useless really because you'd rather have Streaming Wolf Zoro over Lion Song Zoro. Your Streaming Wolf Zoro, uh, you want to have him over Lion Song Zoro because Streaming Wolf Zoro, of course, his special is completely negate all strength damage for one turn, which is much more useful than Lion Song Zoro's just deal damage. Strong Broken X Drake, those two books are also kinda useful. Uh, but mostly Stronghold Shanks books. I mean, how can how can we not love our Stronghold Shanks books? Anyways, guys, I've been Zinigami. That has been T Bone Island, and y'all stay beautiful.